What is going on, Panic Gang, man? Today in this video, we're going to go ahead and talk about the best aim assist values with indeed the Demon version 1 script, all right? Again, this script is completely free to download. It is indeed on the 10th page on the Google Doc, which is linked in the description of every single one of my videos, usually the third or the second link. So go ahead and download the script. All you have to do is just right click on this media file link. It's going to open up over here just like this. And then you just simply go ahead and hit download, all right? Now, I highly recommend you go ahead and watch the setup. I know everyone's looking for the best scripts, but worry no more, we got you guys covered. Click on the first link in the description of every single one of my videos. It's gonna take you guys over into this Podia. Currently, we got five tiers. We got the extreme scripts, okay? This comes with all my scripts. Here's everything that's included in here. Tons of scripts, setup videos. It makes it pretty simple. And again, top five scripts right up here. So you don't have to scroll too much to get the top five best one. Then we also have the ultimate aim assist here. In that tier, you get the aim assist values for a lot of the scripts that you guys just went ahead and seen in the extreme scripts tab, all right? Now, anytime you get a tier that's higher in value, you get all the scripts and the aim assist value as well, all right? Then we got the custom scripts tier. This is where we take your exact settings and make you a fully customized script so you don't really have to adjust too much. And again, that one does take a little bit of time for us to make, usually one to three weeks, but we try to get it done fast, all right? And then finally, we do have the legendary tier Anyone looking for the one-on-one -on -one help? If you're brand new to the Zen, I highly recommend this tier. In this tier, you get on a call with me. We get the Zen best set up for you. I'd recommend you the best scripts and the values. Get it up and running, all that good stuff, right? And then finally, we got the lifetime scripts, right? This is going to include everything in here. And again, it's a one-time fee of 250. Again, you guys can go and get that if you're looking to stay a member for a long time, all right? Now, I did go ahead and open up a brand new self I saw because I know a lot of y'all want just a one-time purchase for all the scripts. That's going to be in the $75 tier. Now, I did open up a $20 a month tier as well. Again, this is per month. And that's going to include some of my best scripts. Again, it's going to be some of the, like tester scripts that you guys can go and test out. Here's all the 10 best scripts. I'm constantly updating these so you get new ones. And then you got this one with some of the other ones. All right. So huge shout out to the 4.5K members, man. Currently part of the podium. Appreciate every single one of you guys. Let's go and get back to the video. All right. Set up video. Now there is one link right here, but I will go ahead and make a brand new one. It'll probably come out within the next couple of days. So I'm recording this on 621. So it'll come out usually by next week, the, aim, uh, the setup video. And then following that will be this aim assist video. All right. So once you got it downloaded to get it in your Zen Studios and in your compiler, just like this, all we need to do is make sure your Zen is up to date, all that good stuff. Hit the file tab up here to the top left hand side. Go ahead and press open. All right. Then you go down to your download section. All right. And then you see demon script. Just press right click on that and then press open. All right. As soon as you do, it will open up just like this. And then you can go over to the programmers tab and you'll see demon. All right, now to get it to show demon over there, this is what it's mostly gonna show. Just on the left-hand side, press the six little lines that says GPC scripts. Pretty simple. Demon scripts, just right click. And then now you wanna drag and drop. You'll see that little square icon with the plus on it. If you're close to it, you'll be able to see it. And then just put it into an open slot. Obviously, I just made this set of videos, so for me, it's already saved in. But if it's your first time, drag it and drop it somewhere down here and then press this play button to program, AKA save the script, right? So once you've done that, go ahead and switch on over into our face cam. Um, let me make sure the controller cam is on. There we go. And as you can tell, the aim assist is indeed working, right? You can see that right thumbstick going crazy. That's the aim assist values I had set up in the setup video, all right? So now to go and activate the script simple, just press the right side big blue button. And there we go. Let's see if the aim assist is still active. Yeah, you guys can see. Whenever I hold aim and fire button, it's still active. Now to go and enter the menus, LT and Y. Okay, it's a little bit different guys. And as you can tell, this one is set to ADS and shoot. I wanna see, can we change that? Or is it just gonna be on uh, ADS and shoot? I guess it just has to be on ADS and shoot. I don't know if I like that. Per precisely i don't know maybe there's got to be a way we can change it okay yeah there is a way you can go ahead and change the aim button when it's activated just hold down y and then press uh r1 right here or it'd be rb if you're on playstation it'd be triangle and r1 right you guys can see so what i want to do is put it on just on ads for the aim assist and the reason is because now look at that 
So let's see. Well, it still doesn't just work on when you ADS. Oh, actually, yeah, there you go. You can see the right thumbstick shaking. That's all the aim assist does in a nutshell. So let's go and talk about the values, all right? The first one's object, object target. Again, just because it's set to head doesn't mean it's going to shoot headshots, okay? Get that out of your head. It's just a name on the script to make it look like it's doing things it's not, okay? This is just, just normal aim assist, guys, okay? Then you got the size. This is going to be how big that circle is. And then the speed, which is how fast that moves, right? How fast that circle moves. That's all aim assist does. Then you got point, which is the tracker that we've had on panning before script and stuff like that. So in here, you can increase that to 20. Distance support, you can leave that on. And then distance S support, just leave it on five. You're good. That's just the dead zone for the aim assist. And let's see what that looks like. You can see the circle is a little bit more shaky, right? You guys can see that right thumbstick is shaking in circles. If I'm using this script personally, I'm leaving everything as is. I'm just lowering my size to about 10 to 20. That would, that would be the values I would recommend. Personally, I like to do 15 on the size and speed and then point on and I just do it on 10, all right? Distance supports, I like just go ahead and leave that off and that's just how I rock this one, all right? And then this is what that looks like. You can see there's still a little bit of shaking, but it's not as obvious, right? So that's the first aim assist. Then you got ultra aim abuse. Let's go and check that one out. We're going to put it on ADS. Okay. Actually, you don't even have to hold down Y. You can just simply tap um, L1 here or R1, right? You guys can see. So we're going to put it on, on ADS, enable it. And then you got strength. I think what it, this one does, it just keeps aiming in and out if I'm not mistaken, right? It usually just spams your aim button, but this one doesn't really seem to be doing anything. So just leave it on disabled. Wouldn't even try it on. And when it comes to the script, I think those are the only two aim assists. Let's, let's see what ghost. Ghost Bobby one. I don't know what the heck that's doing. That's tapping the R1 and Y button. That's weird. Don't leave that one on ghost bot right there. Disable that. And yeah, that's pretty simple for this script. There's just one aim assist and that's a demon aimbot. You guys can go ahead and set it up just exactly how I talked about with the values and test it out. All right. So once you're done adjusting, just press B and B and you're good to go. All right. So hope you enjoyed. Catch you on the next one. Peace and love. Anything I eat.